Okay, I think this should be working. Um, <laughs> turn this up a little bit. Hi, everybody. Um, can't really show my face, unfortunately, uh, because I've been splashed by acid. No. Um, it's Venusaurus here, obviously. Um, just wanted to put this in before this episode of Smooshy. So, I'm sure you all noticed that Smooshy has not been uploaded recently, and I do apologize on that. I, first off, uh, I'm an idiot. I thought I uploaded every episode that I had recorded thus far. Uh, turns out I still had one more. So, that's going to be getting uploaded here. Um, but... Also, the reason why I like videos and stuff has been lacking a little bit is because of the situation I'm in right now. It's not anything bad. Um, it's just our living situation. I believe I've told everyone here before, or made it known that we, me and my fiancé were going to be moving. Um, well, we kept running into some problems with the house that we had. Where it's a rental property my dad owns that we're going to move into. But it needed some fix-up because it's out in the woods, so it has a well water system. And well water needs special, like, pump filter and everything in order to make the water usable. And, you know, not full of, like, dangerous stuff for us to drink. Well, that initially, the, the initial process is that, um... The well water system froze in the that was in the house. The pipes froze and burst. So we initially had to start that, and this was months ago, by ripping out stuff. And the more we kept ripping out, the more issues we kept finding with the floor, with the walls, a lot of mold, a lot of just bad walls in general. So we've been working on this project for a while. And then to top it off that we just kept running into some more complications with stuff. Um, the house is, was literally, like, it's crazy that it actually was able to be a house. Um, so we've been fixing that up like crazy. So we currently are not in the apartment anymore. We're currently living at my dad's house. Um, so I've been able to do some streams recently over on my Twitch channel. Uh, twitch.tv slash venusaurus I'll put the link on screen and in the description uh, for any of y'all who watch my videos and maybe don't know that I do streaming uh, I do a variety of content um, but I've been doing some of that but it's just I don't have a good space here to record it's not good for like the audio not good for anything like that really and so I've not really been able to record anything um, I've been trying to get a little bit better, but also just with dealing with a lot of the stuff going on there, as well as just um, my depression and everything, uh, I can safely say that it's gotten better. Uh, the new medication I'm on is actually helping me quite a bit. So the so my mind's in a lot better place, and I'm feeling a lot better about this. And I'm going to get back to recording Smooshy soon. Um, and I really, I really hope that uh, it doesn't seem like I'm neglecting this game, because this game is legit one of my favorite games of all time. I, I love this game to death, and I'm not trying to neglect it, or neglect you guys who like watching it. So, uh, the next episode of Smushy is here, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Just know that after this episode, um, it's going to be a little bit before a new episode comes out, because, again, this is the last one I have recorded at the moment, so... It's still going to be a little bit, and uh, like I said, I do apologize on that, and also to the creator, Smooshy, if you see this, uh, I do apologize, because um, I love your game to death, and I've been praising it, and I'm so excited for Smooshy the Marketable Plushie, because uh, this is being, rec I'm recording this audio on the 13th of March, um, so new Smooshy episodes will be starting regularly in April, uh, because we are going to be, we're nearly done the house now. Uh, a lot has been done, we're on the final step of it, and so we'll be moving in end of March here. So, new episodes will be coming soon. Just thank you guys for your patience, thank you guys for, you know, just sticking with me and listening to my rambling here. Um, I seriously do appreciate every single one of you. Uh, Y'all are great. Um, also, thank you for over 300 subscribers. That means a lot to me. I love it. Um, if y'all can just keep sharing my stuff around, uh, follow me on Twitch and everything too. Um, that's pretty much it. Enjoy the episode and I'll see you guys later.
Hey y'all, Venusaurus here, bringing you some more episodes of Smooshy Come Home. Last time, we got one blueberry, but unfortunately the stubborn lizard wants two. And this guy has the other one, but we need four more green crystals to get it. So we're going to explore around a little more of Myrtle Pond and get those crystals. So let's go over here. Hello, tall person. Hey, hi, hello. Hi. My senses are tinkling. Your senses? Yes, yes. I'm trying to collect these old circular relics. I think they were a currency of a past civilization. Or they were some sort of frisbee. Still researching, of course. Oh, well, good luck with that. But I'm sensing two more of these relics in this area. I really need them for my research. Where are they? Hmm, I sense they're somewhere higher up. Too high for me to reach. Gah, why are my arms so short? Oh, take it easy. I can find them for you. Oh, well, thank you, kind stranger. Don't thank me yet. Let me see if I can get them for you first. How many did you say there were again? There should be two more around here, according to my senses. Right, your senses. I'll be back then. The senses of coinage the senses of coinage i think that might i think that might be the episode name oh i completely forgot that was the solution there look at me solving the puzzle without even knowing that i'm solving the puzzle hooray we Uh, this game is just so peaceful and fun. Boing. Alright, we found one coinage. An ancient relic. Is this worth anything? Eh, who knows. Alright, go over here. We get some more purple crystals. Not the not the ones we need though. Oh. And we go here for another coin. So the really cool thing I like with this is that all the coins are of like different currency of from like in like the world and everything. I think it's really neat. I'm convinced these are frisbees. Oh, did you find both relics yet? Yep, here they are. Ah, such fine specimens. Starting to rethink my frisbee hypothesis now. Thank you so much for the help. No problem. I've got about 20 of these green crystals on me. Please take some with you. It's the least I can do. Oh, thanks. Now then, time to analyze these relics. Awesome, well now we can buy the blueberry. How goes the research? Still analyzing these relics. They definitely were in a currency, though. I think they might have been some sort of wheels. Further analysis is needed. <laughs> uh, I love the writing in this game. I love everything about this game. That's why I'm let's playing it. So let's go make this trade now. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey, hey. Back for a berry trade. I'll give you one. I'll give you for 60 of those green crystals. Sweet! One blue bee coming right up. We get another blueberry. Farewell, my sweet blue bee. And hello, shiny crystal. Alright. Well, now we got the other blueberry, but we should still explore this area because there's still some stuff we haven't fully uh we haven't fully gotten from it here. Like up here. Oh, there's more purple crystal down there, but more importantly up here is a new type of mushroom. Macrolipitoa procera. I cannot pronounce these. Oh my god. This massive mushroom is commonly referred to as the parasol mushroom. They're often found solitary in pastures and woodlands. However, they're known to form in fairy rings, which is a naturally occurring ring of or arc of mushrooms. Ma smooshy notes. Wow, 
Now these are just perfect umbrellas. I feel so safe under the shade of these beauties. Thank you, Parasol Shroomy. Hi there. A mushroom using the strength of the winds. That's not something you see every day. So it's something different about you. Receive some essence of the wind, yes? Oh, yeah. I spoke with a forest with before and, uh, they let me have some. How peculiar. But I trust in it's in good hands then. So you may have some of mine. We get a little bit more wind. You're very welcome, little mushroom. Yeah, the more and more this upgrades, the more and more it just it just becomes so much more useful. I mean, like most things do when they get upgraded, but still. <laughs> I believe we still have one or two more we still have one or two more things in this area we gotta do. Because I believe there is a shrine we haven't gotten yet. Since the one oh since the one hint did talk about a shrine that we did not uh that you we would get something from doing the shrines. Because while this strawberry is cute, we do need something a little different on our head that's not a piece of fruit. So, we survey from above. And we see something over there we haven't done yet. So we shall go to it. another thing I really like about the openness of this game and like how the uh just in general how the game just works is that you can see from afar a lot of different things so like you can sometimes see stuff like hey what's that I should go over there and explore it or like oh I can't do this yet but I really want to like it's one of it's one of the coolest things about it And again, just the music of ev that every little area has is just so, so good. But here we go. And we slash away the vines and we get the little flower. And would you look at that? We got a purple augmenter. Oh, what a cute little shroomy. But what's it for? So if we go over to skins. I'm purple! Right now, purple shroomy. Which I believe now, since we got that, if we talk to the lady down there, who we met a few episodes ago and asked us to look at the shrines, we can tell her we got all the shrines. Hello! Nice to see you again, little mushroom. Have you come across any of the flower shrines? Yep. I think I fixed them all, actually. You fixed them all? Yep. The flowers were scattered around like you said, but I returned them all to their shrines. I think the forest was happy when I did, too. What do you mean? Well, something appeared every time I returned a flower. The spirit of the forest has been watching over you. That truly is beautiful to hear, little mushroom. Thank you for restoring the shrines. No problem. Please take this with you as a small token of my gratitude. A flower augmenter. Is it a flower or mushroom? I discovered it recently while rebuilding this shrine, but I'm not quite sure what it is. But I feel you may have some use for it. Oh, well, thanks. Wrong thing again. Oh, your fate is a special one, little mushroom. Just be safe out there. I wouldn't want anything bad to happen to you. I'll be safe. I've performed photosynthesis for flower shroomy. But I prefer purple shroomy. And yeah, so as you can see, we've been everywhere on this map except for the little area behind that locked gate. Which unfortunately we cannot get to for right now. But there is just one little area we have yet to fully explore. 
because there is there was some uh, cut vines up here. So we're gonna go explore that, and then we'll give our little uh, we'll give our big new nuisance, big new nuisance, <laughs> the other blueberry. Ooh, this one's a lot. Bunk, bunk, bunk. Oh, you know, we have been up here. I just missed that. <laughs> All right. Well, with that, we've completely done everything we can in this area. So let us go do here. Num, num, num. Gah! You brought me out in the sun! I need darkness. Well, there's plenty of darkness in front of you. Another perfectly shaped tunnel for you to nap in. Hmm. But the one I'm in already is so nice. And I don't know if I can leave it. But, but this one is even darker inside. It is? Uh, yeah! It's got a better angle, <laughs> you know, from the, uh, sun. Hmm. Okay. I'm convinced. And with that, our... Wait, we can walk right through him? Somewhat. Look at him, he's sleeping. Well, since now that he's out here, we have found our way through to the next area. Dang, you really got rid of that big fella. Not bad for a little mushroom. Wasn't easy, but now everyone can pass through. Yep. Are you going to check out the other side also? Eh, probably not. Just going to keep standing here. It's my favorite thing to do. <laughs> Just stand here. All day. And all night. I don't even sleep. I just stand here. Uh... That sounds nice. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> but yeah, so we got the big annoying thing to move. I really don't know what it's supposed to be. I think it's just a lizard of some kind. Salamander, something. I totally forget. But with that, we've now unlocked the next area, which I think we'll go explore sometime in the future well no we can't do anything else here so we're gonna do that next episode <laughs> uh thank you everyone for watching and i hope you all are enjoying the series so far and i hope you guys have checked out the game if you haven't yet it's such a really good game and highly recommend it but yeah you all take care thank you for watching like comment subscribe all that kind of jazz if you would please share this around go check out the game buy the game buy the soundtrack buy other stuff buy things from me i'm not selling stuff but give me money <laughs> uh but no for real i hope you all have a good day and i will catch y'all in the next one later